For this problem, we're going to solve for x and the inequality 2x squared is greater than or equal to 162. First, we want to get the right side equal to 0. So we're going to subtract 162 from both sides so that we have 2x squared minus 162 is greater than or equal to 0. To make this easier, we're also going to divide both sides by 2. So now we have x squared minus 81 is greater than or equal to 0. Now we can factor the left side to become x plus 9 times x minus 9, which is greater than or equal to 0. Now we can find the values of x that make the left side of the inequality equal to 0 by using the equations x plus 9 equals 0 or x minus 9 equals 0. For the first equation, we get x equals negative 9. And for the second equation, we get x equals 9. Now we're going to use this number line to find the values of x that make the inequality a true statement. We're going to do this by plugging in values of x from each region. For x equals negative 10, we have negative 10 squared minus 81 which is equal to 19. This means the x values less than negative 9 will make the left side of the inequality positive. For x equals 0, we have 0 squared minus 81, which is equal to negative 81. This means the x values between negative 9 and 9 will make the left side of the inequality negative. For x equals 10, we have 10 squared minus 81, which is equal to 19. This means that x values greater than 9 will make the left side of the inequality positive. To make the inequality a true statement, the left side must be greater than or equal to 0. This means that x must be less than or equal to negative 9 or greater than or equal to 9. So x ranges from negative infinity exclusive to negative 9 inclusive or 9 inclusive to positive infinity exclusive. And this is the final answer.